What's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? This is SC Pack for another saw you coming to you here. Um, last chance on a layout. I ain't had time to do an update for a while. Been real busy running around with school, but had a little bit of time here and there to work. And um, figure right now probably be a good time to go ahead and uh show you what all is going on. As you can see in the foreground, there's an extension. I'm gonna talk about that here in a bit. But um, let's get started with the town. All right, I'm gonna spend a little time behind the camera because I really need to be able to control this tripod. Um, as you can see down here in this corner we've got a cement plant and downtown I've managed to do a bit of scenery work. One second we get some light on the there we go. But um I've got my feed seed lumber usual jib jab down there. Got my cement plant going. Gonna make a cap to cover the tops of these. Haven't got round to it. Gonna have some elevators and some bins back in here and got around to that. Didn't manage to build part of the thing with pike stuff. Um, part of the building with pike stuff walls. I love those little kits. Um, here's the little downtown area. Coming out here, we got a bait shop on um, Sculpt Mold Hill. And over here, you can see it. You guys, set up for some bluffs. I'm probably gonna sand right there. Get a nice little ditch, and that should be a really nice shot down the way. Um, moving on, the feed mill is no more. I'm planning it. I can't really figure out any way to do the um, corn at all or anything. So what I'm going to do now is this is going to be transloading. This is going to be a wood paneler. I'm going to cut the spur down a bit. But I still should be able to have three cars, so I'll still have an angle nook right there. Nice little switching puzzle. Um, this spur might come in some. I'm still just kind of in the planning stages. I'm not really trying to force anything, just kind of going with it. But downtown's really developed a lot. Um, as you can see, I moved it down some to make it central. And I'm really liking this shot right here because I'm going to have four tracks right there. And there's number 6330. I think I'm about to scrape off the little number decal and the patch over the decal and just run the stock numbers. But I'm probably still going to leave that. Um, and the spur in the foreground is going to have two industries. Fertilizer dealer right here. Based off of one that's local downtown. I need to go snap picks up sometime. But it's really cool. And then down here, I'm not sure yet. I'm thinking maybe plastic pellet, maybe manufacturing. I'm not sure. I might try to do something with box cars. Um, or I might go with hopper cars, so I'm not completely sure. Then up here on downtown, it's going to be Friend Res Cafe. Trees right here. And I'm going to have a cotton farm with a road going out. And then here's my extension. And I'm about to change some stuff up. I built this and I'm realizing that for what I'm trying to do it's not the right shape. What I'm probably going to end up doing if I can get the camera far enough back is I'm going to end up bringing this in a bit to give me some different sh shape bench work and then right here there's going to be bench work. I'm moving my TV and stuff down there. Um, over here I hope I don't look weird and if I do I'm sorry but I'm weird, so it all works out. Over here, there's probably going to be a town with an interchange with a rear, with a short with another short line. Oh, and I have a name for my layout. I'll get to that in a sec. And um, a cottage in and a passing siding. And then on the other side, it's going to be um, a visible staging yard for the interchange railroad and the branch line you see here. And I'm probably going to try to make that um, into something I could use to prop up, like mainline photos and stuff like that. Um... Anyways, let me fix the camera up here. For the railroad, I've decided to bring back one of my old um, freelance railroads. You might remember it from the 4x8. The Aiken Northern Railroad is back. And this time, our line goes from Aiken, South Carolina, to Chester, South Carolina. Interchange with Norfolk Southern, CSX, and the Lancaster and Chester. By the way, the Aiken Northern is completely fictional, but those railroads are completely real. Um... The goal is going to probably be to operate branch lines that have been um, leased off. The I know the line probably from Aiken. I'm going to go Aiken, Edgefield, and then up to Chester. And my story is going to be like the Aiken and Edgefield is original, Aiken Northern, and then we slowly bought a branch line, expanded the line, bought another branch line, expanded to that until we got to Chester. Um, probably going to have some old school EMD power. I want to get... Uh, Southern Pacific GP40 or GP40-2 and a 
Central Georgia GP7. Um, might see some Norfolk Southern Heritage units, least power, you know, and probably some SD45s or SD38s or something. And if I ever get my skills up enough, a GP10. Um, that's about it. I mean, I need to cut my lovely little bench work right here. Oh, and I'm probably going to get a GE70 tonner for the town. And then I'll probably swap that out with like the Central Georgia GP7. This all, of course, is pending how much I get because I also want to start building my car, my fleet roster. And you see, I need to do some more scratch building. And it just keeps building up. So we'll find out what goes on with what um, eventually. Anyways, I hope you all have a good one. And I'd like to announce now that I'll be doing these videos probably monthly or bi weekly. I'm not sure what yet. Um, and then my blog, I'm going to try to update every weekend. And I'll have a link to my blog and all this is going on Facebook. It'll be a link to the blog, link to this video, link to my YouTube channel. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to get active on some other forums. Um, maybe the weekends, I'm not sure yet. School's almost over. I got AP's final push and I only have like four classes to worry about. And then I have finals and then I'm done. And then it's summer and I can relax. So anyways, hope you all have a good one. Um, go Clemson Tigers next fall. Go Green Bay Packers next fall. And go 78 and number 2 to Blue Deuce in Spring Cup. Have a good one.